Hello, what is up guys? Evil Do Us Arm here today, and today we are going to be doing a 1 million coin Bayern Munich squad builder. Um, it's all Bayern Munich players, so I'm going to have um, a little highlight if there's anyone to be given by the player. And um, we're basically just going to run through the whole team. So um, each of these players that um, I like the most, we're going to go with um, Manuel Neuer, Ribere, and um, Mandzucic. Would all, are all going to get individual player reviews, so be on the lookout for those later. I've had this footage for a while, but I never actually made a footage of the team, so the actual team itself, so we went to chuz.com to take a look at it, and um, I greatly appreciate the service that he offers, so check him out. Anyway, we've got um, Manuel Neuer in goal. Uh, his nickname should be Manuel Says No Neuer, because he saves just about everything. Um, Joe Hart and he, in my opinion, are the best goalies in the game. Uh, anyway, moving on, we have Philip Lahm at right back, the Laminator, because it's like the Terminator, and he stops everything down his side as well. Don't be put off by the 82 pace. The passing, dribbling, and everything about him is spectacular, and as you'll see, the shot is not bad at all either. Um, moving on, we have Jerome Butchang at center back, quite the um, defender. The pace is nice, plus he's six foot four in game apparently. It's more like six foot three though, a tall six three. Anyway. Um, gets to a lot of things, an excellent center back, and don't be put off by his stats. He's a really quality center back. I'd imagine his inform is even better, and the team of the season better yet. But I didn't have enough money, because of the other two guys I bought in this team. Anyway, moving on, we have Dante. Um, very solid center back for the stats that he has. A little slow, but he seems like he gets to every header and every tackle anyway, so it doesn't really matter. That's also the thing about Philip Lahm that I'm going to talk about here real quick, is that he seems to get to every header, despite his low heading in height. So, um, anyway, moving on, we have David Alaba, and, um, he is probably the best defender on this whole team. I don't know why the lowest rated would be the best, I guess it's just how EA works, but he, his interceptions are ridiculous. At times, it would be, everybody's gone, Dante's pushed up because of his high attacking work rate, Boateng's been beaten, Lam is too slow to catch up, but Alaba, for some reason, just has that determination, I guess, put into his code in the game to get back and make that last-ditch tackle, get that toe poke in, or to intercept that seemingly impossibly clean-through pass that makes you throw your controller at the TV. But anyway, his defending stats, all kidding aside, are spectacular. So um, definitely an amazing defender for this team. And definitely worth any Bundesliga team you'll put together. I'd make an individual review, but I don't have any footage of him making any defensive plays. Anyway, moving on to right midi, we have the one and only Aaron Robin. Left foot amazing, right foot eh. Uh, it's basically about sums him up. His dribbling and pace are spectacular, beats any outside back in the game that I've come up against in Ultimate Team. It's just ridiculous. Um, and his shot beats any goalie with his left foot every time, or if it's his right foot, if it's a tap-in in an open net, his right foot sucks. So um, there's no other way to put it. Moving on to the center mid is um, Bastian Schweinsteiger. Um, his weak foot, I forgot which it is, is not good at all. I don't have any highlights of him scoring any goals. He was a holding midfielder. He did the job very well in that formation. Sometimes he would just hold back and stop counterattacks. But when he did push up, he'd always play that key pass into someone. So his passing is very good, his dribbling is very good, and his defensive stats are very good. All around great holding midfielder, although the 60000 price tag is a bit high on him, or 44000 I think I got him for. But he's still a little high. Anyway, moving out, left mid, Ribere, Ribere, just, I don't know, five-star skills is amazing on him with the high dribbling and pace, he just moves around people, you'll see in the highlights, I'm, he's just spectacular, his shot is decent enough to score a goal, but um, it's, it leaves something to be desired for, what, nearly, I got him for 560000 and his price has gone up since then, for that much you'd expect someone that can finish every sh opportunity. And unfortunately, um, Ribere can't quite come to that. So for that much, you're better off just buying Andres Shirley's inform if you're going to go for it. And um, But the only thing is, though, with Robin and Ribere, they're the only two, besides um, Ronaldo, that have high attacking work rate and low defensive work rate, which is exactly what you need for a 4-5-1 in this formation. You need those two guys to just sit up there and overlap and switch out with Mario Mandzucic at striker, who you'll see in a bit. They have a tendency to do that, and when they do that, the entire team throws everyone off, and that's how you score goals. So without those, they've dropped back too far, and you can't really run a 4-5-1. Um, anyway, moving on to the first cam, we have Shakiri. You notice he's playing out of position. Um, 
That is because he, of his pace. We need you need pace in your two cams. Thomas Mueller, the other one as well. Um, you need pace in your cams in this formation, and his shot is also really good. And um, I'm going to have another talk about how you play players out of position, and they have no difference in their abilities whatsoever. We'll make a video on that later too as well. Um, <laughs> so don't be too concerned about the total chemistry of a player, even though Shakiri had three <laughs> in this team because that's not a real yellow, that's a red for, or position boot anyway. Um, be only, even though he only had three, he still played spectacularly throughout all the games, and um, I only have one highlight from him, but moving on. Müller, um, amazing, amazing center attacking mid. I'd make a review on him, because I had so many goals I scored with him, but it'd just be a waste of time. No one would watch it. He's so cheap. So... But he's an amazing cam. If you've never tried him out, um, I highly recommend it, especially in this formation. Pushes up, overlaps, the high, high work rate gets him running back and helping Schweinsteiger in defense. And then that lets Ribere on his side move into his position, which when Mario Mandzucic drops, it's just, it causes havoc. And that's why this formation is so good for this team. Um, anyway, Mario Mandzucic at striker, ST, um, yeah. I mean, I feel as though I should just let these highlights play through and let you just be um, as dumbfounded as I am about his aerial ability, which is exactly what you need in a striker. He has high, high work rates. So basically when you run this formation, nobody is up on the field at all, except Ribere and Robin. Both of them are lazy and don't come back. So you have two guys out wide when usually your opponent's fullbacks push up, and Mario Mandzucic drops into the hole like a center attacking mid or center forward. When you play that first ball to Mandzucic, he has one of those two wide open for a through ball to send them running on their way home, which is really an excellent thing about this formation. They don't move in like forwards, they stay out, or they drop into Mario Mandzucic's spot, which is amazing. But anyway, enough talking about those two. I really like those two, how they work together with Mario Mandzucic in this formation. And uh, anyway, so that is the team. Um, it cost just under 1 million coins. It was like 998,000-ish, I think. So uh, I, I guess it's enough to call it 1 mil. <laughs> the highlights of the team are Ribere and Robin and Alaba and Lam, Dante, Neuer, and Mandzucic uh, are all the highlights, and Muller, if I said Muller already. Um, they're the highlights of the team. The other players, you can kind of get away with using someone else. And on the same note, Ribere and Robin aren't really worth their price tag, so feel free to use like a Farfan or a Shirley, and then this team's only 200,000 team at that point. Um, but you will be missing the five-star skills and the amazing shooting powers on the uh, right side of Aaron Robin. Um, I'll be reviewing single players on this, as I already said, um, so be looking forward to those, and um, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, hope it helped you out a little bit, hope it helps you to make your team, and um, anyway, thank you for watching, and be on the lookout for those other videos. Like and subscribe, this video took a lot of time, so uh, thank you guys, um, peace.